Hi class, uh, so I'll be answering the who or what pushes your stress button. Uh, so before in my life, I would say myself, I have a type A personality. Uh, so I think I, I myself am my worst enemy with my stress factors. Um, and I was uh, doing better at that. I was really working on just trying to realize that a lot of the stress that I was putting on myself was just so unnecessary. And um, so over the summer I was, I was doing pretty good about that, uh, not really knowing a lot about these uh, labs and exercises and techniques that I've been learning throughout the book. And uh, I've been trying them and, and they have been working for me, but the problem is that I get relaxed, but then all of a sudden I snap out of it because I realize that there's just so much to do. Um, so as, as much as I see that it does work, I think that it's going to be more of a factor that I am going to really take into effect um, once I'm really done with this and I can use throughout my life. And uh, I know it's something that, you know, we're really trying to focus on now, but I see how this can work and I'm using all the notes and um, the tips. Uh, you know, chapter 12 talks about a whole bunch of different ways. Yoga, um, I remember that working, and, you know, a lot of people know about yoga, but just the different breathing exercises that they give us, um, the progressive sleep, relaxation, and um, and, the, and they, they do they do work. And then, and I know that, um, that I need to take time out of the day to practice them now. And even though they may not solve the problem, I will remember them um, and I will apply them uh, not only for myself, but for my students too, because I know that they're very stressful. And uh, the other issue I think is, is um, I mean, it's stress and it's just being upset with the, the system and the food that's given to these students. Um, they they qualify for free or reduced lunch and they, yeah, they get a banana and an apple, but you know, the kids just throw that aside and they eat the, the little bit of a greasy pizza or chicken uh, wings or whatever they give them. And, and I think that it's hard as a physical education teacher then to try and get these students who aren't eating well to uh, to then try to go out there and perform, perform a physical activity after eating this food um, or before when they're on an empty stomach uh, or they get the little bit, you know, in the morning. Um, but they're not drinking water, they got the mask, which hopefully get, you know, uh, removed once the um, mandated vac vaccination happens here soon. But, um, but I want to use these tools to apply in um, my PE. I think that I never thought about using it before. And I think that um, introducing that, especially because I've been at an IB school and I can see how things can work differently. I want to apply that to my students and really try to get them to feel that because um, as hard as it may be for, to get middle schoolers to, to stay calm, um, I think it'll be useful and uh, it'll take a little bit of time to insert, but, but once it hits, um, I think that that could be a way for me to try and uh, help myself and help them uh, so we can both benefit and that way they can get some stress out because I know they have plenty of their own stresses as well as I can get mine and um, and I can take what I've learned here uh, the labs and I can give it to the students and I can assess them and I think it'll just be an all-around win so I've been saving all of these labs and putting out extra versions of them and uh, I'm gonna make copies and and once I uh, get a job uh, and I start making my own units, I'm definitely going to put this as one of my units. And um, it, it just works out perfectly to, to apply um, because it's an easy assessment um, for themselves, for me to, to assess them. And it's extremely beneficial and I don't think it's used enough in the school um, system or just even thought about. And so um, I, I really like this idea. It's easy for these students to, to fill out um, or do together. And uh, it's an easy way for me to kind of keep up with them since I'll be with them every day. So I look forward to, to taking these skills that I learned throughout this rest of the course um, 
and applying it to my own life uh, outside of school and inside of school with my students to make for a better life, uh, uh, better life and a healthy lifestyle overall. So um, really enjoyed uh, answering this and being able to see uh, what I can do for the, for the future. Thanks.